Big name game mashups are nothing new in the world of gaming. Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games, Tatsunoku versus Capcom. But there's some serious history at play with Street Fighter Cross Tekken. I'm a big Street Fighter fan, so I've been hanging out to see how Street Fighter Cross Tekken plays out, and it's so much fun watching Ken and Ryu KO their Tekken cousins. Negative. Everyone knows Tekken's robot Yoshimitsu is the ultimate fighter. His laser sword conquers all those puny Street Fighters. Yeah, right, Darren. Yoshimitsu's special move is getting dizzy and falling over. <laughs> Street Fighter Cross Tekken keeps the anime look and basic moves from Street Fighter 4, but it also injects a lot of new twists. There's a huge roster of fighters from both games, and there are a handful of bonus characters like Mega Man and Pac Man. Yeah. Here it comes! These characters are only on the PS3 version though, so don't go looking for them on Xbox. This game really embraces its new two-fighter tag system. You can switch between fighters at any time. For the ultimate punishment, I recommend tagging your partner in mid-combo. You can even bring both fighters out at once for two against one unfair awesomeness. Yeah, there's no denying this game packs a lot in. The new four-player mode was a real surprise. I thought it worked really well. Being able to tag in one of your friends as your partner makes perfect sense, and it's a lot of fun. There's also a scramble mode where all four players are fighting at once, but that felt a bit too crowded. Bajo, how did you find the mix of Tekken and Street Fighter combat styles? Well, this game was made by the Street Fighter developer, so it plays like Street Fighter, but with Tekken characters in it. I, it would have been nice to have a, a good serious mix of both, but I think I actually preferred it this way, because I like Street Fighter more than Tekken. I always thought Tekken was a little bit slow. Well, if you're a Tekken fan like me, you'll need to wait for the upcoming Tekken Cross Street Fighter. It will feature the same character mashup, but instead be built with Tekken's 3D gameplay. I did observe some Tekken influences present in this game, however. The way rounds now end instantly when either one of your fighters is KO'd is a Tekken Tag Tournament feature. Don't expect to see noob-friendly features like automatically tagging in your second fighter after the first one's defeated. I think it's important to note that for spawnlings that haven't played a game like this before, they're going to have to get used to a six-button control scheme, which can be a little bit tricky to learn, but it is worth learning. Or you can just go for the button mash, which I am guilty of on occasion. <laughs> What are you giving it, Bajo? I love a good mash now and then. <laughs> I think this game takes the best parts of Street Fighter 4 and puts in some good tech and stuff too, like the tag team and also those amazing super moves. This is a great fighter. I'm giving it 9 out of 10 rubber chickens. Well, I can appreciate that there's some seriously in-depth stuff here for Street Fighter and Tekken fans, but it would have just been nice to have the option of a simpler button layout for newcomers that was a little bit more accessible, so I'm giving it 7.5. <laughs> <laughs>